Hello guys and welcome to another Let's Build video. Um, today we are building this fire truck. So this is part American, part British. I don't know, it's a cross between the two, but to be fair, I do like the design of it. Um, but before we start this video, um, this is a new world for tutorials. And every, every vehicle will be classed in here. So far we've got the tank and we're going to have the jeep as well later. But first... Um, for the tank um, tutorial, we've come up with a new design for the gun where you can actually fire the gun, so it's just a bit of redstone repeater on the end, just above the dispenser into the line of redstone like that. And as you can see, it fires quite nicely. <laughs> see, there you go. It, it'll fire, so you can have an actual working gun on the tank. I'll only be able to shoot one area, but there we are. Um, so yeah, down to the fire engine today. So this is a fire engine. It's got space for three people in the back. Got steering wheel. Um, you could change it so there's a ladder on the top, but the ladder looked a bit too big and out of proportion to the rest, so we left it out. These are like hose bits where you pull out the hoses. There's a few buttons and stuff on there. So yeah, so we'll get started then. So first, all you want to do is put one black wall. Then go back five, one, two, three, four, five, oh, five, and then another black wall, and then on the back just one, and then two, and then you want to come across four. So it's to scale with um, most things I do in the tutorial. The Jeep is to scale to Jury's tank. The tank wasn't to scale to be fair, so it probably isn't to scale to the tank, but. Um, it's into scale with most other things that we'll be building so if you want to build a city then yeah sure go ahead um, so you want an extra bit underneath so you can add the door so add that on both sides like that and then the buttons on the wheels like so Oop. there we are so that's what you've got you've got this shape here buttons on both sides Okay, then all you want to do is fill in the base, like that, um, and then the next thing I think will go onto the front, so you want stair there, and stair there, we'll, st we'll do the bodywork before we add the like bits, like the lights and stuff, um, so there we'll add like two bits here, as like the front engine bit here, and then on top of that will be the glass, but we won't build that yet, then you want to go up two like that and two like that on both on both sides then you want your glass panes and you want to just drag it across like that to make that then you have the wing mirrors just add them Whoop. oh no it's a bit close so we'll take one off for the meanwhile um, and then you want to just build up like that but this gap here you have to move in so the third gap to the back you have to leave out and then the rest is just get out the way cow and three like that so that's so you've got like this sort of pattern coming on here to be fair you could cut out the back or maybe add extra compartments and stuff it's not really up to you maybe have that back bit is like open we've got like a hose pump and stuff um, and this back water tank thing on the back here um, so yeah, we'll add like that, so we'll make it like the other side, it's quite symmetrical to be fair. Um, the next thing is the roof canopy thing, so we'll add that on. And all you want is quartz slabs, this could be a bit expensive if you're making this in creative, oh, I mean, survival I mean. Um, so yeah, just bear that in mind. We tried to make the um, tutorials so you're able to make them on survival quite easy, but sometimes we have to compromise because it looks better for the model. Um, and then you want to add these two stone slabs on the back. Um, on top of here we have this tank, so you want to fill in this part here, so you've got that. And then you want, oh I got any white wool on me. Um, take out the black wool, there you go. Um, you want to add on this top bit here, so just take out them four blocks like that, add that on top, carpet on top. We'll do that in a bit though. Anything I've got missed? No. So yeah, that is basically what you've got at the moment. 
So next thing you need to do is add the door. So you add a door, button down there. Okay, go around the other side. Door there, button down there. So that's you've got the doors. Um, we'll do the inside in a bit. So now on to the decorations and add-ons to the outside. So I'll get rid of that. So you want signs, item frames, yellow wool, dark blue wool. Um, where's red wool? Uh, red wool. Um, uh, what do you need? Tripwire hooks, um, levers and buttons. I think, oh, and ladders, that's it. So yeah, the tripwire hooks could be a bit hard to get, but to be fair, they do look quite cool. So you want to add two ladders on there for the grill. Um, sign, add like a number plate at the bottom here. You can fill it in, and up here, you can put the fire department's name up there, maybe. You add on two of them, and just blue lights like that. Then you want to add two things there, and then, oh no, not blue lights, whoops. Well, you could have blue lights to be fair, but I think yellow is better for this. So there you go, so you've got the front there. And then the next thing you need to do is you need to add a layer of signs along this back wall. Oh, apart from this middle part here where you have to have a ladder. Um... And then you want to move it around the back as well. So yeah, it just kind of adds like a border, makes it look a bit different. Um, there you go. And then we'll add whoop, that. There we are. Um, then another sign there and another sign there. As the wing mirror should be there. Um, and then the next thing, you need three, six tripwire hooks. Three on this side and three on this side. Next thing you need to do is add this like, little thing in here. You can really add anything you want in there to be fair, but um, I chose to add this. Kind of like a hose. Now the back part, oh yeah, um, we need the cobblestone wall. Take that. So on this bit, you're going to add a button and a lever just above it. And this is going to be like the main pipe, and that's just going to build up like that. So while we're at the back, we're going to add these. Add some red lights for the tail lights, um, that, and then also some blue lights. You don't really need the blue lights on the back, but I thought they looked quite nice. And also the carpet as well. There we are. Fill that on. So like that. This is what you've got from above. Side view kind of thing. Well, they're basically the same side, so doesn't really matter. The next thing is the interior. So if you come in here, it's a bit hard to get in to be fair. There you go. So you're going to need some signs. Well, I'll get them. Signs, uh, item frame, a disc or a black piece of wool depending on what you've got. Um, birch seats. You can have really any type of seat to be fair, but I chose this. Um, and a lever for the gear stick. Um, where is it? There it is. Okay, and these buttons have to be here on the sides just so you can get out. Okay, whoop, you gotta get in there. So the back seats here are for two firemen, buttons on both sides. Here's just a bit of decorations to add on the signs. You don't have to have the signs, but I think it looks a bit nice. And then you plop in a seat like that, on that, that, and then the gear stick has to facing forward like that so you can drive your fire engine maybe add a few lights in here it's up to you to be fair we haven't added lights because just haven't had the time and this was kind of a rush tutorial but there we are so that is what you've got guys you've got a fire engine I'm sure you can add bits to it it's not completely set in stone <laughs> there you go there's Drew working up a new creation could be coming to your thing soon <laughs> So yeah, this is the fire engine guys, hope you enjoyed the tutorial, leave a like and a comment, and tell us what other ones you'd like to see, any vehicles, buildings, anything really, so see you and goodbye.